you know, there's been plenty of sort of parodies of the slasher genre, uh, really dating back to Scream. And uh, to me, Scream is not a franchise that holds up very well. It's, it's a little bit too much actual slasher and not enough parody. Um, there was a movie, though, that came out not that long ago uh, that really gets it right. And nobody saw it, and I doubt many of you will have heard of it. It's called Final Girls. Um, directed by Todd Strauss Schulson. I think that's right. Uh, Final Girls is a, uh, is a really great parody of the slasher genre, while also being quite the effective comedy and drama. Uh, it involves uh, a young girl played by uh, Tysa Farmiga who her mother, Malin Ackerman, dies in a car accident. And she, Malin Ackerman was starred in this Friday the 13th style movie. Uh, I think it's called Camp Bloodbath or something like that. And uh, uh, her daughter, three years later, gets roped into uh, going to this screening of it with her friends. And, you know, she's sort of racked with guilt and sadness about her mother's death. And, uh, long story short, through uh, circumstances that are never really revealed to us how this happens, uh the daughter and her friends end up inside this movie. And they're, they have to abide by the rules of this film universe. Um, for instance, any, uh, anything sexual, and they, they take their top, uh, one of the girls takes their top off or anything, the killer's going to show up and murder them. That's what's going to happen. Uh, there's no getting around it. Um, there's no escape. They try to run from the camp, and you know they're running this way, and then they just end up coming this way, and it's just a loop. They can't get out. And they have to figure out how to escape this movie, and the only way that they can think to do it is there has to be a final girl. And the final girl from the, the original movie because of their actions, is inadvertently killed. But only the final girl, the virgin, can kill the, the slasher. And uh, it's really fun. It's a fun movie, and it's a very touching movie, because, of course, when the daughter goes into the movie, she interacts with her mother. But it's not really her mother. It's, it's the character her mother is playing. So they don't recognize, you know, the, the mother doesn't really recognize her because she's playing this sort of silly uh, slasher bimbo. And, you know, the, but the daughter, all she sees is her mother. And there's some really sort of poignant and touching moments between them, between the friends. Um, it's fun to see sort of the culture clash of of uh, an 80s group of movie teens with like today's teenagers, you know, and some fun bits with like Adderall and uh, what what is this cell phone device that they have. Um, it's a fun movie and it's a movie that you might actually make you missed up just a little bit. Um, again, I'm sure a lot of you haven't heard of it. It's really worth seeking out. If you can find it, it's I no I don't know that it's playing on any streaming sites, but go to Amazon, hit rent, uh, spend a couple bucks, you won't be disappointed. The movie is Final Girls. I would give it a solid three out of four stars. It is very worth tracking down.